Welcome back to Living 808. The 8th-ranked University of Hawaii Beach Volleyball team is headed down, uh, right down to the final regular season stretch with home matches this weekend against number 20 Arizona and 14th-ranked Georgia State in doubles round-robin action in Manoa. That's a tongue twister. Free admission to fans, though. It's one of our favorite four-letter words. And uh, you can come down and cheer on the team for the senior celebration. Coach Evan Silberstein and senior Brooke Van Sickle join us now live. Thank you guys so much for being here. Appreciate Thanks for having us. Thank John. you. You guys are having an amazing season, and you're finally back home. Let's just real, real quick tell our viewers about how the season has gone so far for you guys. You guys are 22 and six, I believe, right? Yeah, it's been a it's been a great season so far. We're certainly enjoying the process and stepping up to all the different pressures and the different challenges that have been laid out in front of us. Playing a really top ranked schedule. We just finished up off on a road trip. We we're able to win against all the Big West competition, which is a great primer for everything we're going to be doing at Big West Championships next weekend. And also playing a lot of best national ranked teams. We got a big win over LSU last week. Um, also to kind of propel us, get us home and ready for this last uh, senior stretch so we're excited to celebrate everyone you guys just keep keep to, uh keep on putting out amazing performances that have put you in the eighth place in the country and you've already played georgia state didn't you just recently play them yeah, they were uh, part of the East-West down in Manhattan Beach last weekend, so we were able to get a 4-1 victory over them. But we know they're going to come out here retooling and definitely gunning for us, so we're excited to uh, take them on again. Yeah, uh, this is the last couple of uh, regular season matches. You still have uh, the Big West Championship, I believe, um, next week, right? Yeah, we're hosting. We get to host every four years. We host the Big West Championship. We do that at Queens Beach. So this weekend is in Manoa, hoping folks are going to come out for that. And then after that, next Friday and Saturday, we host the Big West Championships on Saturday is going to be the final day where we're looking to host the crown at that point. Let's talk about this week weekend real quick before we get to Brooke. Um, it's, it's a senior celebration. You get to come out and it's free. Uh, but tell us about this weekend's matchups. Yeah, it's Georgia State and Arizona, both well-coached, both ranked programs. So certainly good test for us as we get down the stretch here, kind of come out of conference and play against national competition. We've played them both over the last couple years, so we're familiar. Um, we're really just excited to be at home. We play really one big weekend at home on campus, so this is the one for that. And we have sixth grade seniors that we're celebrating. So looking to just come out, again, enjoy the process, You know, trust the training that we've been doing and step up to the pressure that we've been building up. Up and just keep uh, you know playing our best volleyball for those that don't know what a double round robin is it's three teams each of them playing two matches a day so you're looking at three three matches each uh, day well it's two matches two each matches. day two, okay. it's three total on campus two, two for each you, day two for each day. we play georgia state and arizona both days so on saturday it'll be in the morning i think we play at 10 15 and 12 30 and then on uh sunday we'll play i think it's at noon and then again at 6 30 that's going to be a tv game also on oceanic so if folks can't make it down certainly tune in and watch us on tv Okay, so Brooke, let's, um, if, for those that don't know Brooke, I don't know where you've been, because she's <laughs> an amazing volleyball player Thanks. indoor, but I want to know about your out, because you're an All-American beach volleyball player. That this, you're just... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's been a really good experience. I mean, the sports are different, you know, it's indoor, it's more of a power game, and, you know, you got six teammates, and beach, it's, it's definitely different. It's really fun, because, you know, you have to touch the ball all the time, and, you know, it's just you and your partner, going against the elements, the team that's across the net from you, and then also the sand is really deep, so it's really exhausting sometimes. But, you know, it's, I like beach, yeah, it's really good. I was gonna say, anybody who's run in the sand or tried to jump in the sand might actually know a little bit more about how strong your legs probably are. Yeah, no, it's, uh, <laughs> the, the sand is very deep and it's, it is exhausting. I bet. Yeah. Um, tell me, as a senior, what do you hope to accomplish? I mean, I, I, obviously it's win, but I'm sure there's a little bit more. You've seen seniors go before you. Um, just your thoughts on what's happening this weekend and uh, your, your collegiate career. Yeah, I, just, I mean, personally as a pair, like me and my partner Kaylee, I just hope that we continue to win out. Um, that's just, if we could do that, then it's going to help the team, you know, just getting the extra point to be able to like relieve some stress on like other teams, maybe other pairs. So we just want to be like a stable, consistent force at once. Um, and then just continuing with season, like I just want to be the best teammate that I can possibly be for my teammates and just make sure I'm always supporting them and make sure they're having a good time. Because I mean, without them, like they make the environment fun. Like they're giving me the experience that like any senior could ask for for their last year so. I've always told my kids um, when, when you want to play a sport, think of something that could actually uh, 
you could move on to as an adult and play. Volleyball is definitely an Olympic sport. Beach volleyball is an incredible Olympic sport. What, what are your future plans? Um, so as of right now, for summer, I'm planning on uh, doing the AVP tour. So I'm gonna still gotta figure out which ones exactly I'm gonna do and who I'm gonna play with, but that is the plan. And then potentially maybe playing indoor, like in fall in the off season for beach, just to, you know, travel the world, like get to experience new cultures and everything. So it's kind of still up in air, but we're figuring it out. Two matches this Saturday and Sunday uh, at T.C. Ching's Beach Volleyball Complex. Um, and then next week, the 21st and 22nd, it's the Big West Championships. Just your final thoughts on this weekend and next weekend, Coach. Yeah, we're excited to, you know, embrace the pressure that's in front of us. We want to play our best volleyball at the end of the season, you know, with the help of Brooke and other seniors, we're prepared to do that. So we're looking for a strong finish to the season, and we certainly want to invite people in the community out to support us. And also want to put a plug in, we've run and getting ready to run our camp series coming up at the uh, in June. So June 6th to 8th, we've got a big camp. We've got a cakey camp. So if you're out there and you have um, little ones and they want to get out there, 9s to 11s on June 2nd, and we got a June 3rd camp. So June's going to be a big camp for us. Uh, month for us too we want to make sure that folks that like you said that you're telling your daughter a lifetime experience in beach yeah. volleyball we want to start we know people love volleyball in hawaii we really want to get people loving beach volleyball out and kind of visit campus and so come visit this weekend and then come back in june um, after our season and camps are always fun plus the extra work doesn't hurt right yeah, it's great. Uh, we get to bring some of our student athletes out there as well, and the rest of the staff gets to get out and participate. We have really, really great numbers for that, so it's a really good kind of staff interaction with the athletes, and it's been a really great um, receiving so far, so it's been fun to do that. How do folks get uh, tickets, or how do they become a part of the, the camps? That yeah, I mean, you can certainly catch us on Instagram, at UH Beach Volleyball, or just Hawaii Athletics Camps. Just go over to the website at UH Athletics, and you can follow everything from there. So definitely uh, come out and check us out. It's going to be a great season and a great summer. Normally. I would ask you how folks get tickets to this weekend, but it's free. Yes. It's free. So all you have to do is head down to the TC Ching Complex and support super seniors like Brooke here and Coach uh, and the entire team. Thank you guys so much for, for being here today on Living It Away. Appreciate awesome. it. Awesome. Thank, Thank you, John. You.